It's been a week since your accident, and I've studied your case very carefully. So here's the good news. You're alive, and you can walk. <laughs> uh, in accidents such as yours, people rarely survive. You're one of the lucky ones. But there is also the bad news. You have a slight fracture of your spinal cord, and there is nerve damage. Now, I strongly advise against an operation. Uh, there's a high probability it would paralyze you completely. As it is, the spinal cord fracture has paralyzed only a few muscles of your face, here and here. Basically, this means that you will smile for the rest of your life. Great. Nice to meet you. You. How could you? You know that you ruined my life completely. I'm sorry. It was an accident. It wasn't my fault. It was your car. How could you even be smiling right now? Uh, listen, you, I. No, stop. Go. Hey! Hey! Your bag! Your bag! Taxi! Follow that taxi, just like in the movies. No, I I'm serious. Follow that car, please. Oh, I, I got it. You're just joking. <laughs> no, no, I I'm not joking. Uh, uh, my face is paralyzed. This is not a smile. This is a hidden camera show, isn't it? No. Isn't it? Yeah, I thought, no. I thought the camera felt different, man. Look, I'm going to act like it's not happening. Uh, so, where would you like to go, sir? <laughs> this is good, man. This is a good day. I knew it was going to be a good day. What's my ukulele? Ah! Yo, let me call you back. Yo, what's so funny, man? Oh, come on. You laughing at me? I said, are you laughing at me? No, I am not. Well, then what's so funny? Jesus, I am so tired of this. This is not a smile. My face is paralyzed. You want to know how I smile? That's how. And that's how I'm not smiling. See? Now I smile, now I don't. Now I smile, now I don't! Got it! Yes, who is it? I brought you your bag. <sighs> All right, uh, I guess I'll just leave it down here by the door and go away. Give it back. I, I want to apologize for the accident. I feel just... You have no idea. God. No. Not again. I lost my entire career. I was this close to primetime host, and now... 
Now I need a handkerchief. Oh, there's one in your bag. What? You went through my bag? Well, that's how I got your address. Please, I calm down. I am calm. Why don't you stop smiling? I can't. No, just leave. Please, just leave me alone. All right, all right, I'm going. Stop smiling. I, I literally can't. I, I damaged this nerve in my spine, and now I'll smile forever. I, I'm really sorry about your career. OK, OK, I, I'm going. Uh, just please don't cry. I'm not. Wait, what? You locked yourself out? Yes. Well, I'll call a locksmith. So you have nerve damage, too. And then I got fired. Luckily, I got a part-time job. But with this smile, I can't show up there. What's your job? Funeral director's assistant. What do you do? Console the bereaved. Wow. <laughs> That's ironic. Yeah. <laughs> ironic. Oh. Don't cry. I'm not crying. This is from the accident. I have nerve damage, too. Something to do with my lacrimal glands. You know, the tear ducts inside of our eyes? Now, every time I feel any kind of emotion, whether it be sorrow or joy, I cry. And I was a news reporter. Right now, I'm actually smiling. 